And what I'm doing here is monitoring whether the signal is good, whether the range, the dynamic range, so the communication with Jean Louis synthesizer is appropriate. I can adjust things a little bit live. Uh, but for the most part, I'm uh, just like you, kind of experiencing what, what happens and trying to pick up ideas and, uh, for new performances and uh, perhaps new research plans. And I think particularly uh, sailing over there, you see that bump, the alpha? You can even see it in the time course. There we go. Alpha activity is a representation of the cortical excitability of the brain, especially here in the back of the head. It represents the cortical excitability of the visual cortex. So what she tries to do to increase it, she will she will disengage from her visual experience. This could be either in the body or in abstract thoughts. Um, and as she told me two days ago when we did this, it got her. She noticed the effect when she felt this kind of vertical falling into herself. So gradually I'll, I'll uh, introduce new rhythms and, and uh, sequences and, and try to affect, uh, affect their uh, uh, while they're listening and use that signal to patch that back into my own uh, sequences that I've added.
Prettier? Yeah, yeah, there it'll be go. on. Uh, it should be on conscious TV. Mm-hmm. Episode. Ay, ay, ay. So, uh, no more serious, serious talk for me. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no, this one will be. Are we rolling here? Cheers. Cool. So, uh, so what, what was that like? What were you focusing on, thinking? All I know is I've done some kind of like neurofeedback thing before, and I'm pretty ADD, so my thing was going all over the place. Yeah. You know? what was going on there, you know. In the beginning, I was actually, my master told me last time, <laughs> this is my second time only, he told me to count uh, seven by seven. Like, so I was, I started with that, and then that became really boring. <laughs> 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 After a while. So I don't know, and then eventually I started listening to the music. I think there were some beats, and um, I don't know, afterwards, you just start thinking less and less. Well, this is the first time I do it with not alone. <laughs> a, a duet. A, a duet. duet. It's yeah. my first duet, and it was really interesting because it was like usually there's like one focus, but all of a sudden I, I kind of felt I went a lot of different places. So, focusing on her, focusing on the music, going inside, focusing on the body, and sort of going a lot of different places. At any point, um, 
and we gotta get you over here. Because, uh... Actually, both of them, right? Yeah. Grand Master Synth over here. Uh, so, did you, um, what, what is your, just tell us what you do for the folks at home. <laughs> yeah, well, um, I take the signals coming from these two subjects here. Uh, <laughs> subject, <laughs> subject A, subject, a, subject, a, subject B. B. And uh, so they're going through, um, going from their heads to Steven's computer. And then from there, uh, CV signals, and, uh, control voltage is generated. So I route that into my modular and, and try and make something interesting out of it. Cool, it was definitely the most interesting modular